So there, there are multi, many ways um, at the individual level or at the group level, community level, that we can reduce that, that plastic that gets into the ocean. Uh, at the individual level, uh, it steps could be include just picking up your own garbage, not, not throwing your garbage or littering. Uh, that's very important. Um, choosing what to buy that to minimize packaging or extra plastic is another thing you can do at the individual level. But as a community, um, there, there, uh, cities and uh, jurisdictions come up with uh, uh, regulations and laws to force manufacturers and companies and people to, to reduce their plastic. Um, in Canada, one of the good examples is uh, where I live in Nova Scotia, um, plastic bags, you can't get plastic bags at uh, grocery stores anymore. And that's a law. Um, and so people, at first, they were like, oh my god, you can't have plastic bags. Uh, but they found a way to overcome it. They bring their own cloth bags now. And cloth bags are reusable, they last longer, and that's slowly reducing the amount of plastic. Uh, and, and other garbage is, um, it's just not about plastic bags, other things too are like, like, there's a big push for paper straws. Uh, or not even using a straw. Why do we need a straw anyway to drink a, a beverage? Why do you need a straw? Um, so again, reducing the amount of disposable items uh, is is very is 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 uh, important to kind of reducing that amount of plastic.